Hello everybody! Welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're a returning subscriber, thank you. Uh, if you're new to my channel, please hit that, that, that subscribe button. Um, so this is uh, Finished Object Friday. <laughs> uh, I haven't gotten a lot done this week just because Christmas and holidays and tomorrow's New Year's Eve, so it's been kind of crazy around here. But I do have a little bit to show you. Um, so I showed you guys this, this in the Whip Wednesday video. This is my husband's scarf to his hat. He has a matching hat. Um, it's using, uh, I love this yarn from Hobby Lobby. It's, I think it's called Print. Um, but this is just like the different shades of black and gray. They're just granny squares. He just wanted something simple. Um, so I wove the ends in and finished that. Um, this is the hat I was working on for him. The gray one. Um, out of the Bernat Velvet yarn. Uh, it's done. It fits him. He loves it. He wanted to, he tried to take it <laughs> to wear today, but I told him, I said, I gotta make the video first. So, he was a little upset, but he, he'll be alright. Um, this is a hat that I, I still have to weave my tails in. Sorry. Let's just try to hide that. Um, but this is a hat I started a while ago, and it's with the Lion Brand Ferris Wheel in Cotton Candy. Um, holding two strands together. Um, I just picked two cakes. I didn't, I didn't color control or nothing. They didn't start in the same place, but everything played out pretty good. I don't know if you guys can see that. But, um, it's kind of big. It's a slouchy, slouchy hat. Uh, because I have a lot of hair. So, I need a slouchy hat so I don't feel like my head is getting squished. So there's that. And then part of my tails, the tails still need to be woven in on this, but I made these coasters. Um, this is peaches and cream something. I get it at Walmart. I don't know if I have. No, I don't. Um, but I get this at Walmart, and it's peaches and cream, and um, it's the same granny square pattern that I'm doing for my blanket. It's just basically there's no chain spaces in between the granny clusters. It's only a um, chain one in the corner. So it's three double crochet, chain one, three double crochet, and then you just do granny clusters with no, with no spaces. And these make really good coasters. I like them a lot. So I have three of these in this color and then I have this is um also peaches and cream it's it comes in a cone though and I forget the color of this but these are just some of the same things just same same pattern just different color and um yeah sorry about that Just trying to hold it it's not wanting to stay very well um sometimes I'll put a single crochet border around it just to make everything neat but uh, I don't really I don't worry about that too much it's a coaster it's gonna get used and dirty and you know so, and then this one I just played around with some white. Um, the white is, I don't know if it's peaches and cream. I know one of the colors of white that I had was Premier Home Cotton, I think. Um, but yeah, I was just playing around. And I think it came out looking nice actually, so I might do that from now on. I might just do 
the color in the center and then like a solid color on the border. I don't know. <clears throat> but that is pretty much that's all I have finished for this week. Like I said, it's been crazy with the holidays and stuff like that. Um, I can give you a blanket update. So, this bag is full of granny squares. Um, this is the Ferris wheel and cotton candy. Mayan brand Ferris wheel and cotton candy. I, um, I don't know how many granny squares are in here, but, um, I could probably put some more in here. But it's, the bag is almost full. Um, so that's coming along pretty good. I still have two cakes to go. Plus what's in here. So two of these balls and a little one. And then um, two full, two full cakes. And there are 270 yards in each one of these cakes. And it's a medium four weight. But it's a roving style. So like what roving style goes from thick to thin. So it's like. But it evens out at a four. So. Um, but yeah, that's what I've been working on. That's what I got done. Um, hopefully next Friday, since the holidays are almost over. Hopefully next Friday I'll have more <laughs> finished objects to, to show you. Um, I do knit also. I'm not, I'm not an expert. I just know the very basics. Um, so if you guys are interested in seeing uh, my knitting, let me know in the comments. Uh, and I'll make a video of my knitting projects, like what I'm working on and stuff like that. I only know the garter stitch, so, you know, I'm very basic with it. I just, I taught myself how to knit uh, through YouTube. So it's a, it's a learning process. <laughs> But, um, yes, okay, so everybody have a happy, happy new year, and I will see you guys in 2023. Thank you so much. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Bye.